Laughlin, Joe Chandler, Nick McCann. What's up, guys? Yeah. Hockey day. It's hockey Happy day. day. Happy hockey day. Joe, what do you normally do to celebrate hockey day? I watch as much hockey as I can, which this year is not much because my son looks at the TV and I we can't have that happen. Do you Wait, do um you, do you people say, call do you do it like, hockey day or is that I don't know that they call it <laughs> <laughs> I call it hockey day. I love hockey, it's my favorite. I missed it very much. I'm very happy it's back. Is there is there like a a red zone for the NHL because that is like my ticket to I can have it on and my kids you know what I mean like red zone there's no commercials and so I can put they, football on and not worry about like whatever Halloween trailers coming up NHL TV like has it but it's not the same as football where you're like okay they're inside the 30 like we know that it's like the game like is back and forth so much it's hard to sort of predict if you're going to get action but they do have that program got it it works more like the MLB network one where they sort of pop game to game and they'll show you a couple minutes and Okay. Do some analysis and stuff. Cool. Well, uh, we are here tonight to open some hockey cards. I have like a million uh, Series 1 Upper Deck cards. It's the only thing that I've been able to find at Target. And every time we go, I buy something. So um, so that's what we're doing tonight. We're going to start. Uh, like, let me just show you what I got here, Joe, because you'll be excited. I got this is a uh, mega box. We've got some fat packs. We've got some. Yes. Young guns, tins, uh, Ooh, like more tins. of those. Wow. So I mean, you know, we're just gonna <laughs> we're gonna hopefully. Is Connor McDavid the cover guy for every one of those things? Yeah, Looks and like and I've been watching a lot of um, hockey like card videos because I you know I don't yeah. know a lot about the product. And there was one guy who made me laugh. He calls him Connor McJesus. Is that a thing, <laughs> or is that guy just really funny and clever? I think it's a, I don't know. I haven't heard it before. I don't know if he originated, but I will say it is Connor McDavid's birthday today. It oh. is. It's a very exciting day. So it is hockey day. It is hockey day. Well, a, the warmest happy birthday to Connor McDavid from the Tox Chrome crew. By the way, if you're watching on YouTube, please leave a like and subscribe. If you're watching on any of the other platforms we're trying to stream on, thank you for watching. This is like, I can't even send an email in 2021. So like the fact that I'm trying to do all this is way too much. Which is why we streamed dead air for three minutes, and I apologize about that. <laughs> Let's start with this Young Guns tin. Joe, what do you say? Let's, Let's do, do it. it. So, um, here's what I know. Are we, are we hunting a Lafreniere in, in this pack? That's the, the thing. I think that's the, right. the main draw here. Um, what I know about these cards is the base cards don't sell for a ton, even the stars, even like a Connor McJesus or a uh, Nathan McKinnon or a uh, Sidney Crosby. How am I doing, Joe? How am I doing? You're doing great. So yeah, what's this guy? Been around for a while. What's this guy's backstory, Joe? Why Lafreniere. He's the yeah. number one pick, going straight to okay. NHL. He's like the you know the the next like Crosby level prospects, basically. Got it. Okay. But but also you know, he's behind McDavid, who was that level of prospect as well. So he's just like the next big guy, and he's straight to the NHL. The Rangers snags him in a pretty lucky draft lottery, I'd say. Mm. So this is the the tin. These are pretty cool. Um, there's nine packs, I think, and then you get one uh, OPG rookie pack. It's got three cards in it. And you got like a little tin to keep like loose cigarettes in. If you I was want. gonna say, what, yeah. what was the SNL sketch where you used to say like you put your weed in it? It kind of reminds me of that. Because um, you can't put a lot of cards in here, so that's the thing. But I guess you could put some keepsakes. Well, and like with the rounded edges, it would destroy the cards. That's, right? It's that like was what I was thinking. For card storage. All right, so I've got uh, whatever the math I came up with was. Um, I think that we are supposed to, because it's one in four odds to pull a young gun out of these. So I think we'll get 15 and a half young guns if we get through all these cards. Young guns. Uh, I don't know how the half's going to come. I hope it's not like a card that's cut in half. Um, so I was thinking we could do, let's see if this works. Is it not going to work? I had, a, like, I had a counter going off. Hold on. Let me see if I can do it here. My, my computer's just being really lame today, of course, and we're trying to go... There we go. We got All a right. counter. <laughs> so, <laughs> so right now, right now. Oh, and I was going to show you also, Nick, so we could see it. Um, you want to see what the guy looks like that we're looking for? He looks like this. That's the card. Yes. That's okay. What we want. So if What's we funny that, about that counter, Sean, is that uh, I start that counter off when I'm watching Young Guns the movie, but I started at seven, 
And as they all die throughout the movie, I just can't count it. Down. <laughs> yeah. but, I had a, but I had a Young Guns thing too. Let me see if this is. Well, I was going to hope we stopped at Young Guns. There, there, there. There. there it is. Those are the there guys it. that we're looking That's for. That's it. Young Dermot Mulroney. <laughs> So the only that's the actor is... I notice when I see that. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly you're not a fan of my best friend's wedding. All right. So what's cool about this is I haven't opened up an upper deck product like since the late eighties, I feel like. And it, it has that vibe. It was the remember the foil logo? Yeah. You know, it just like mm. instantly you're I like, like oh, that I picture in midair. That's a good So, so what's the backstory of D upper deck? just focusing on hockey so just... i don't think it was a just focusing on hockey i think that i and i don't I, I would love to know more but i think that yeah tops basically has a monopoly with baseball so mm -hmm. it yeah. probably it probably came down to money like everything else does um love him bark a great player james neal there's a name i got He's been uh, a long time. Two, I just went through the whole pack. No, that's it. That's All the right. pack. No pack young one. guns. So like Keep I said, one and zero. four. One and four. So still at zero. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm not actually able to like monitor if anyone's chatting or anything. So if one of you wants to help me. Um, oh, I bet the I bet the chats are blowing up, Sean. Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, Tom, we had we had two people say something on our um garbage bill kids. kids. I, I think will say one of the comments was like, stop doing this. I hate saying this because I, <laughs> I'm a hockey fan, but I've sat there more garbage belly kid fans than uh, hockey fans in the world. <laughs> it's okay. I'm actually, so I, I dug into some of this because like I said, I had, we just found a lot of it. And so yeah. I've opened some of this already and it's, it's really fun. Um, hitting a young gun is fun. So we got John Klingberg and Zach Hyman. Zach Hyman. And then look at these. So this oh. is an insert set called UD Portraits. And All right, very... I, know, I know how to say the name Dallas. Say the name. Uh, I would I would guess Roman Jesse. Is it? Am I reading it right? <laughs> Yossi. Yossi. Yeah. yeah I was hoping he's... you were going to say Nashville. That's cool. <laughs> that was... <laughs> so these are, these are great. I like those, those. Are great. I like those a lot. All right, we're going to move on here. We got lots to open, and there we go. All I'm right. not loving these. This one in four feels like a little bit of a lie so far. Well, we only opened two, so it's not. Wait, one in four packs. I think it said one in four cards. No, that would be easy. I was like, that seems... Yeah, okay. they don't do odds. Right. God, these upper deck packs are so hard to open. That's Some say the adventure is just opening the pack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I have like 60 packs of this, it's going to take too long. I should have pre-cut all these. Um, all right. Let's see what we got. Cut them all and then rip a whole pack of PK. Is it PK. Suban? Subban? Suban. I was Suban. watching him tonight. I was watching hockey. He's a man. His, uh, his brother. Oh, we got one. We got a young gun. Yes. Wait, let's see if we can do this. There we go. Yeah. Young gun one. So that's Igor Zamula. Igor Zamula. Oh, it's actually wow. Yossi, Sean. <laughs> um, cool. All right. First young gun out of the way. He, he was wanted dead or alive. Right, Dallas? <laughs> That's exactly right, Nick. <laughs> All right. Young Guns 2 or Young Guns 1? What was a better movie? Two. Young Guns 2. There's, there's yeah, no question. Two, two is better. Arkansas Joe, Dave Rudaba. Oh, this is this thing where you saw it as a kid, and now, because this happened to me with Die Hard 2, where, like, apparently it's a universally hated movie, and it's my favorite Die Hard. From Die start Hard to Die Hard 2 is this next? Die Hard 2 is my favorite Die Hard movie, and it's oh. because I saw them when I was a kid, and I wonder if Young Guns 1 and 2 are the same thing. Uh, Young Guns One is the better film. Yeah, that's what Young I mean. Guns Two is a better movie. <laughs> All right, <laughs> I know exactly. Very sim there's Connor. Similar. There's, there's right Connor. There. Oh, I love that card. That's a that's great. A, card. That's pretty. That's good. a good card. That looks like he's walking on water. Okay. It's weird because he's not on the ice in that moment. Some more base. Um, apparently, they have these cards where they're in French, so it looks just like this. But I guess all of the writings in French. I haven't right. got one of those yet. Those might only be in hobby boxes, but um, all of this is retail. Dallas, do you know the difference between retail and hobby boxes? Yeah, um, retail is uh, retail, and then hobby boxes are like young guns too. Yeah. Just curious at, at this point in the show. If you I have no clue. I, I haven't <laughs> so, been um, researching at all. No, it's okay. That's what we're here for. So, like, you bought a hobby box. It sounds like you're disappointed. Well, I am. Okay. I, mean, I, I have I to like, produce like the, the show, ones, and all the you have to do be... is just listen every once in a while. 
The French ones may be just available for sale in Canada. No, I think you can like, get them out of these packs. I'd love to get one out of these packs. Um, maybe France. If you want to talk about any of these guys, Come on. no, no, me. I'm just loving it. I'll, I'll oh, stop okay. you if so I see Okay, so check these me. out. So an insert. Th this is canvas. There's my I don't boy. Know if this is actually canvas. That looks like a but fan. It has kind of a canvas a... vibe <laughs> to it. You can kind of see the cross stitching. So Who's these are really the cool. Smile? If you got a, a, a Lafreniere out of, out of one of the canvas ones, that's a good card to get. So Dusty. Um, the these are the checklist cards. So this set is, series one is 200 base, so veterans, and then the 48 um, young guns. Right. So this one shows off uh, numbers, what is it, 101 through 200. So, and then there's a series Brutal two. Brutal checklist. Yeah, the checklist is great. Crazy. <laughs> All right. So this is our first box and it was a tin of the young guns tin so i think we're supposed to get God, the odds would say we're supposed to get two young guns in this box the entire box in this in this yeah in this one the tin that i had so if God, it's I nine am. packs then we have a i mean I guess we have a chance to get a third but that's crazy to call that entire box young guns, though, and then you only get two of them. <laughs> Apparently, you used to be able to get more. You, you maybe would get three. Um, Tyler Sagan, that dude, he's, he's sure crazy. Sure he's Cancel. Off. TJ, American hero. Yeah. Is, um, you're a Red Wings guy, right? Uh, Red, I grew up Red Wings, and there's Anze, Anze Kopitar. Uh, and I've like become a big Kings fan since I've been here for so long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, I got Dodgers the Kings rookie. I feel like Gillardi. <laughs> is that a guy? Yeah, Gillardi. Is that right? I, I got there's one two of in the young guns I saw. Two Kings. Jeez. The big Kings rookie is Turcotte. And I, don't, he's, I don't think he has a card yet. So, Tops cards, say what you will about them, but. You can open the packs. I'm, oh, getting there you go. I'm just going to go get scissors for the next box of these, man. I'm going to be here all night. Sean, were you going to explain the difference between retail and a hobby no, box? No, you can go oh, back okay. and some of our older videos. No, I will. Um, I want to see. There's something in here that looks different, so we'll see what we got. Oh, you know what? It, oh, it's another canvas. Carrie Price. Oh, Carrie Price. That's a good one. Um, Sometimes I get tricked because it's like you see they're all that like left yeah. hand border and then it's like, oh, what's a goalie doing that? I like that picture for that. It's pretty good. Don't care for the player. Um, that's what I was going to say is a hobby box usually has some kind of guaranteed um, hit, like an autograph. So when you bought that Series 2 box and you got an autograph of Tuki Toussaint, am I wrong? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was promised to you by Tops With retail... Um, usually it's, you're going to find it in a target or a Walmart and there's no guarantee of anything. Like I said, you get, there's always going to be odds. Gotcha. Uh, so, you know, you have a chance of hitting, like you can see a canvas is one in seven. So we've done pretty well on those cause we've hit two already. Um, you know, a, uh, if you got a canvas young gun, that's one in 48. So whereas with hobby, usually you're going to get that through like a card store. They're not going to sell hobby boxes at Target or Walmart. And you're going to have a guarantee. Like you're going to get an autograph or a relic or something like that. Mm. Gotcha. Okay. Arnold Nurse, I love that. Oh, right. So we have two Young Guns. All right. So that's kind of better movie. The odds. Young Guns. Young Guns too. Arkansas Dave Rudaba. Wait, wait. Sorry. What was that last card? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Was a little bit of a... All right. Thank you. Yeah. Um... Joe, who are you excited to watch, like team wise, and then also, are there any players that you you're a fan of? I mean, I just it, for me, I love McDavid. The, I'm like I, the Kings and the Red Wings are both way down right now. The Kings have a lot of really young rookies that are, look good. So for me, I'm like rooting for the Oilers. The Maple Leafs have a lot of really likable guys. A lot of young dudes that are super fun to watch. So I just sort of root for whatever team is fun to watch right now. Cool. And I'm always kind of rooting for Canada, honestly. They need it. They could use a win. So we've got a Dazzler, <laughs> and these are these are really cool. So um, check this out, Nick. I think you like these. Oh. Ooh. You know that guy, Joe? <laughs> Jonathan Huberto. I love these. 
It looks like, remember the scene cool. in Boogie Nights where he thinks of Dirk Diggler? <laughs> <laughs> That's what it reminds me of. Um, cool. And yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll show off. We got our um, OPG. I guess these aren't, people don't like these because they're not really sought after. So this is just like a bonus here? I'm just going to tell you right now, I'm going to get scissors. That's impossible to open. That's so funny. Taking, yeah. taking too long. I mean, a Tox Chrome scissors with labeling. I mean, <laughs> we're, I, think, I think I'm ready for it. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you can sell those. Yeah. Make some cash. For the Comet Boys. It's a good thing no one's watching this because they're just making fun of me for not having all open packs. <laughs> Sean, right, what if I'm you open that pack up and it would just... <laughs> okay, let's open these fat packs. I gotta know what's in there. Glossy. Oh, okay, man. I want to go. <laughs> if, I were, if I were a comment boy, I'd be like, that Sean O'Donnell doesn't have magician hands. <laughs> <laughs> I think you cannot do... A, yeah, you have to open it. Can't do a card opening show and then give up on a pack. Literally, the one thing you're supposed to do. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, did you watch yeah. that show? Was it good? No, they couldn't even open cards. It's a card opening show where we just try and quit halfway through. <laughs> um, so then these are three rookies. Worth it. Yeah. Yeah, was it? The, yeah, was it worth the it? The senators, <laughs> by the way, the senators are look to be very, very stacked with young guys. So they should be really fun to watch. Maybe not this year. Maybe next year. This is a fat pack. You've probably seen these hanging up, you know, somewhere. Kind of got the little thing right here. So. Yeah, well, like more retail probably than there, hobby box. Yeah. There you go, yeah, Dallas. More of, a, more of a retail set. Thanks, Although guys. You, Thanks. you can probably find these at your card store, too. The card store will have both. A Target will usually just have one or the other. All right, the only bummer about these, you can see it's way more cards than the other packs, but you're still, it's a one in four chance. So, you know, mm -hmm. like you're ever going to get like two of them in one, which would be great, but let's see. Uh, Walked great. away from the bubble. That's a great name. Oh, did he really? Tell us that story yeah. while I go through these. He he just decided, he was like, I think he had some, uh, somebody in his family was a little unhealthy and he just like literally walked out of the bubble like four games in. There's your hero, Sean, for your local yeah, boys. Although he, yeah. he showed up and was we were supposed to win the cup and then that didn't happen. Yeah. So but we, you know, one man hockey is more much more of a team game. It's not like basketball you get Durant. Canvas of Claude Giroux. Giroux. What's say it Giroux. again? Giroux. Giroux. Okay. All right. This guy McKinnon is arguably the best player in the NHL. But he I was, I, I'm he was on my sworn to hate the Oh game, yeah. By the way. I know. This guy I know. He's awesome. Yeah, I have a deep hatred of the Avalanche, so I can't get into him. But now explain that. Uh, well, the Red Wings and the Avalanche had a massive rivalry in the like late '90s, early 2000s, when I was watching hockey at all times. Here, yeah. I have a background ready to go. <laughs> and uh, I truly, I like, I still hate that team. They were. There we go. Let's okay, this it. is a retail. <laughs> <laughs> so this. Oh, is that the? Is that? <laughs> this was the revenge. This was the. Re that's Claude Lemieux, not Mario. Okay. Who's Claude Lemieux's son is currently playing in the NHL. There so it's go. like it's like baseball. We're old. All He's like Ozzy Ozzy Canseco, right? <laughs> no it's this weird thing where he's like legit a great. He was a very good player. He was also, I mean, you know. Mario is Mario is like the maybe the greatest ever, but Claude Lemieux was a pest and a good player. So it was like he he didn't score the goals, but he was a, if he was on your team, you loved him. He's a goodness. maniac. These the the packs in this box easier to open. Nick, tell me about the Hockey Hall of Fame. Was that fun? <laughs> yeah, you know the Hockey Hall of Fame is a it's a really good time. You can ooh, a lot of, <laughs> that's, what happened? That's, that's a good a, one. That's a good one, right? Connor McMichael? Yeah, he was the captain of the Canadian World Junior team that just lost to the U.S. in the finals. He's he's legit, Connor McMichael. That's a good one. All right. A lot of, a lot of Connors in hockey this year. Yes, there are. Yeah. <laughs> I know that guy. Don't score. Did I say that right? Yeah. Don't. Don't. Wait. What, how'd you say it? Don't score. <laughs> don't ski. Donsky. Don't, Patrick Roy. Patrick Roy. That's a, Patrick Wah. No, wah. I, I know. That's why I said that. <laughs> All right. Never mind. It was just that one pack that was posing as an easy to open pack. 
Oh, it's okay, man. Sean. In year here. four, we'll look back and you'll be like, remember the first year when I didn't <laughs> I couldn't have, even open packs? I didn't have, I didn't have calluses. <laughs> There's probably a trick to it. Of all the in all the hockey card opening videos, no one ever taught me how to do it. So um that's their secret. They're not sharing it with the competition. I think you need, uh, you need your you need there we your, go, Martin man. Jones. My keeper. You got him from the Kings. Um, oh, wait, what is that? That's a cool card. Yeah, that is a cool card. All the cards of them off the ice are really dope. Is that what like is that? A, um, is that a throwback uni? What's that uniform? I think it's just an. That's not a throwback. I think it's just an alternate. I actually haven't seen that before. That's a cool looking uniform. Do you know where Upper Deck? Uh, guess, yeah, guess where Upper Deck, uh, like where their company headquarters is. Carlsbad. It yeah. is in Carlsbad. That's whoa, nice. really? That's yeah, I was pretty... gonna say La Jolla, but yeah. Oh, wait, 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 hold on, Sean, Sean, you just skipped like my no, no, no. right under the top card. What did I do? Right under the top card. No, no, in your in your left hand. Sorry, buddy. One, yeah, there you go, Drew oh, Dowdy. Daddy. You skip Drew Dowdy. I'm sorry. You gotta look at Drew's wonderful face. Now we can move on. A lot of focus. Oh man, not a great. Like, I mean, it's just a standard, but that's that's the man right there. Looks like a manager at Discount Tire. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> He's weirdly like a super popular player with like media because he talks trash all the time and he's super goofy. He's a lot all of fun. Right, Nick Foligno. Foligno? Foligno. All I right, guys. We got, we got three young guns, and it's 9.35, so let's pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> we're moving pretty fast. We're, we're doing all right. Carter Hart. Here, you know what? I, I know something's going to help us here. I um I like the Twitter names, but I did something better for us this week. Let's see if it works. Uh-oh. There we go. Launch <laughs> on. So these I are actual garbage pill kid names. <laughs> oh sweet perfect this is my <laughs> background you. i appreciate it um so far this is how i'm feeling about the lafreniere chase not going well oh no not going well i feel better about finding a lafreniere than actually opening all these packs without hating upper deck you know all what right. it's in carl's bad we'll take it nick and i'll take a drive <laughs> got a portrait i've driven um, by. it's right by the callaway headquarters Oh, so nice. we, should, we should do both. We'll go. That's one of your young guns, right? Check out a, the, our is golf. He, is he a rookie? Oh, he's a rookie. Think, that's cool. Yeah. So I think the portraits are nice, but if you get a portraits rookie, that's even better. Those cards look like what you would get if you put a, a quarter in at like a roller rink. And... <laughs> yeah. They do have a, like a Saved by the Bell, like, I, you, yeah. like the, the photo do. booth at the max. Beauty school dropout. All right, here we go. Maybe they're just hard to open because they're designed for little kids to open and we're grown adults. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Wait, that was the perfect card to look at when you said little kid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, do, I like that card. That's great. Uh, we got another card. That's David, such a good card. We do I love have a young gun and it is Morgan Geeky. Morgan Geeky? Geeky. Morgan Geeky? Yeah. I like those jerseys too, by the way. I think yeah. those are those look That's good. A great name. And uh, I hate those jerseys. I hate the the Vegas ones. That's yeah, a, that's a yeah. fantastic card right there. That is a good card. Edmonton, Zach Kassan. That dude will pick a fight. All right, did I count that one? We got it. We got four young guns. Yeah, we're at four. I love that. How many likes do we have on YouTube? Right. Do we have four Wait, likes? was that? What happened? Did we count the portrait one? Does that count? That doesn't count. All right. Uh, I'm only going to count the blue ones. Um, I guess if we got a canvas one, which is that'll be tough to do, I'll count that. I like I like our odds. All right, I think we have like one in three if we get through all this. Yeah, I really don't like our odds. Like I'll be honest. So look at that's there what we, we go. Want. So if Velarde ends up being a beast, this is a good card. Yeah, I've seen him play. Nice. He's, played some, awesome. He's played some games. He's played some games. Kirby Doc, this guy just broke his wrist. Poor Kirby Doc. Oh, it looks like it. This looks like the inner monologue of Kirby Doc. Yeah. About what he's going to do once his wrist heals. <laughs> Kirby Doc. All right. All right. I'm going to sleeve and uh, sleeve up that Velarde. Tally it up, too. Hold, please. Yeah. Do we have to add that? Did I get it? That's good. We're yeah. going to add that. We're at five. Coming. Young Gun Five, which we are. there should have been five. I think we can all agree there should have been at least five Young Gun movies. I mean, yeah. I mean, they really shot themselves in the back. On yeah. Part how far two. do you think they got into Young Guns Three before they're like, eh, you know? I Isn't consider that one where you like hasn't why hasn't there been a reboot yet? Like <laughs> because they're too good. Oh, is that I'm true? sure. Is I mean, the problem true. with that and with most movies like that is like you have so many guys who you yeah. have to get to agree. 
I think right, I consider right. Tombstone to be Young Guns 3. <laughs> uh, fair enough. I can't be alone. I'm not alone in that, I don't think. I watched some clips of Young Guns today. Young, yeah, I think it was the first one, the one where they do pe- peyote. Yeah. yeah. Oh the, spirit, the spirit horns. Hey, yeah. Y'all yeah, see yeah. that chicken? She's my, she's <laughs> yes. my butterfly. Yes, I mm. almost just like, I was going to put that in the show. <laughs> And I ran. Well, you don't need, you don't ever need to do that. You can just, hey, you guys! <laughs> just have you guys start doing it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we're in the spirit world. We're in the spirit world. <laughs> they can't see when, us. When's the peyote episode of Tox Girl? Yeah. Oh, Let's go. Right, I'm having a hard enough time. William uh, Nylander. I have a hard enough time trying to stream sober. Okay, so I think we got some cool, Joe. Are you ready for this? I'm ready. Check this out. We got a jersey of Carter Hutton. Ooh, that's pretty so cool. What are the odds of getting a jersey? Let's see. It's, Joe, do you know um, who Carter Hutton is? I do. It, it's one not in that 20, exciting. Oh, one in twenty-four. Gotten, All right, that's not. It's not impossible. It's still pretty cool. That's still cool. Yeah. So he's not. It's not like the coolest. It's around. not the coolest guy ever, but it, it is a cool. Uh, Be cool if he was. No, he might still have a future. I, I'm not sure actually. Be cool if it was Connor Hutton, right? Totally, because that's the, that's the most important hockey if name. If you're good at hockey, your name is Connor. Hey, leave us a like if you like Connor Hutton. That's not his name. Yeah, I think he's a good player, but he's not a, he's not top tier. I think. Mm. All right, let's see. Ice dancing. Get it. Yandel, Yandel trying to set the consecutive games record. Charlie Conway. What, do you know what that record is offhand? <laughs> I do not know it offhand. God, that's so cool. uh, Sean. Yes. Is that the one? I think we saw Radulov score. I think Sean and Dallas both, Nick, were there. We saw him score two goals in a minor league hockey oh, game. because we went to a Dallas. Uh, are they the called Austin the Dallas Stars, Stars too? They're the yeah. Austin. Or the, they're the Texas Stars, which I, I love. Blanket. I have my blankets. Still somewhere the Dallas Stars are the NHL team. Their minor league team is called the Texas Stars, which I enjoy that they went for the whole state. Sorry, everyone. That's awesome. I have to fix this. <laughs> this is falling down. Eventually, it'll just be like backwards, and then that won't help anyone. Is that the right guy? Appreciate everyone watching. We're trying. We're doing our best. It's first time really going live on more than just YouTube. So we're doing great. I'm having a good time. Yeah, I'll I'll be doing better if we hit hit our man. What is that? That's a pretty sweet jersey. Wait, how do you say that name though? Uh, that juice. is juice. juice. Yeah. Even if it's not, it is. Juice. Wait, Juice Soros? Isn't he that guy who's paying all the Democrats to do so? <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> Oh, Morris. and we got another <laughs> Velarde. This is the regular nice. Young Guns. Oh, that's nice. Well, that would count, right? That counts. Boom. The only thing I didn't do Wait. was a sound. What was the other Velarde? That was that was a that was his canvas. Hard, that's oh, a hard, we got the, I didn't realize so his canvas. Nice. Where a. That's why you case that one up because I yeah, was like, because, I do think McMichael's a bigger pull than Velarde. No, it's um. But canvas. Is and I'll probably key. will in the end sleeve all. I just didn't want to do over. If I hit a Lafreniere, I'll, I'll do that. Lafreniere. Lafreniere. I'm saying it right. Lafreniere. Right? Yeah, you're doing great. Um, uh, the canvas is one in 48, so that's a that's a tough card to pull. Nice. That's a good card. Yeah. Um, so we, we got, got a portrait. A portrait. Oh, there's a Vander Kane. I think if I'm going to get yeah. a jersey, I'm going to get a Kane jersey. He's, All right, he's in portrait. the news right now. Portrait is. We had. We got, we got oh, yeah, we, we had that. that. Here, that's right? twice Ooh. on Roman Yossi. All right. Yeah. Kind of a bummer. There's Carter Hutton, regular. Evander yeah. King is in the news. He de- he's declaring bankruptcy. He may not play. What? How do you declare bankruptcy while you're playing? Uh, he sounds like he's like $30 million in debt. It sounds like a real disaster. Oh, oh, nice. He was the one who's re- he's been challenging Logan Paul to a fight on uh, Twitter a lot. Oh, f- fun. Do I have that right? I'm pretty sure I have that right. Okay, we've got a Dazzler. And it is of... The same dude we had the other Dazzler of. Great. Hitting some uh, repeats. That goalie at the top, Shesterkin, is that a rookie card? Because I know it's just a basic, but he is a big prospect for the Rangers. He made, And I don't think he would have had a card last year. It, but it doesn't I, say I, rookie. Yeah, he probably was not eligible. He probably had one last year. Because um, I think that he would have a... I think he would be a young gun. I mean, they have 48 young guns. I don't think they left yeah, those out. Yeah, totally. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. 
Almost... Do we have more viewers or young guns? What do you guys think? I can't see. Mm -hmm. some, yeah. some, one of you look at um, <laughs> young guns. Check, one of you check YouTube <laughs> to see if actually if we're even live. I'll look. The YouTube so canceled to go live already. A nightmare. All right. Come on, baby. Another McKinnon. Oh, we got a UD canvas of Tyler Bertuzzi. Tyler Bertuzzi. And all right. Sharks don't play till tomorrow. Yeah, there's only I think there's Red like six tomorrow too, right? Yeah, Kings start tomorrow too. Nick, are you are you watching the Bruins or are you just wearing a Bruins hat because your wife? Oh, I we're in a Boston house right here. I, mean, I just didn't know. I didn't know if uh, your wife was still. Oh, my mic is all messed up. If your uh, wife was still a big Bruins fan. She is. Yeah. We, uh, you know, Tyler Sagan's a real, real important figure in this house. But uh, <laughs> they're, 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 they're a little, uh, they're a little dismayed that I guess they have to say goodbye to Charo. Chara. Chara. Chara's gone. That's a big deal. I think that they're going to be better off for it. I got to say, it, yeah. I, it, I think it was time. Reed well, Duke. They, Reed Duke. That's a great That's name. a good one too. Boom. They're a fan base. They're a fan base that's been given everything. Yeah. So it doesn't really matter. <laughs> I mean, he, I, Chara played there for 15 years. I mean, like, yeah. Yeah. They won the Stanley cup when they had that like racist goalie. Yeah, that guy. Was, that was the guy who wouldn't go to the White House to see Obama. What yeah. year was that? Uh, Tim Thomas, wasn't that Tim Thomas? Tim Thomas, that yeah. is correct. What year was that, Tim? Nick? That was 08, I believe. No. 2010? Uh, 10. 10. I think it was 2011, because I think I was in Boston that night. I remember we were on tour. They it, won the NBA title in 08. That's it. Yeah. It was 11. It was, it was 11. 11. I was there. I wasn't like, you know, there, there, but was it a bar? They, Ovi, there, that was our first Ovi. That's the man. Very They've nice. won like twelve titles since. Quinn we... Hughes, he's a big deal. Yeah, that, that's that's a big deal. He was but last this is year, his second rookie, year, right? Yeah, he. I think he won rookie of the year. I think so. All right, that's, portrait of great. Thomas Shabbat. Shabbat, I knew it. Cool. I'm just, I'm just so disappointed in those portrait cards. Why? I think they're yeah. awesome. I just because in my mind it's like some upper deck executive is like, you know, it'll be cool, and then that's what comes out. Yeah. It's weird because, like, the, I, I mean, I like Robax it. works I so well, but it's like you want it to be based on something that actually existed. Like, when we opened the Chrome and you're like, oh, it's based on the 1993 card. Yeah. I love that look. Yeah, That's but the, the background the background looks like, okay, I this follow. is what the, the picture isn't oh. enough. Tony yeah. D'Angelo yeah. quit Twitter, by the way, over the uh, recent political movings. Oh, they are going to say because of our three minutes of dead air. Hey, no, I'm sorry to do this at home, everyone. This is going to keep falling until it like, falls on the ground. Uh, I'm, we're going to get a lot of complaints. No, hey, no we're at Young Gun 7. It's a good night. No, <laughs> one's, <laughs> no one's watching anyway. I need to get into some new stands. We're figuring Nick, it out. You were, Nick, you were diving into the specifics of the portraits card. I wanted Please to hear do. what you had to say. Yeah, so with the problem with it, and I have a lot of, I have a lot of notes. <laughs> but, uh, the background is really funny and retro, but the, the picture... Yeah, the picture has no... It needs to be like that mall portrait, yeah, glossy. glossy. Uh, mm -hmm. They need to like get them to actually sit yeah. for a portrait. Like a glamour Tuka. shot. That's that's legit. Tuka Rask is real real great. Yeah, that's Tuka Rask. Canvas. The non-racist. The non yeah. Uh, <laughs> but we... <laughs> I think he was on the bench even in 11. I think he was on the team. He was, he was yeah. yeah. But then he's been the goal. He's been their guy for a long time. Maybe not anymore. I don't know. But no, he's the guy. He's still the guy. Yeah. All right, let's keep moving. I've been to a Boston Bruins game. It's a real fun time. So we do have Coulter, a Young Guns. It is of Josh Norris. Josh Norris. The Senators are coming up. They're going to be legit. All right. I feel Damn. like we're. I feel like we're doing better than the odds on the Young Guns so far. I haven't been to an NHL game in a really long time. It's really fun. I went last I know, year. I always have so much fun. And um, <laughs> okay, but I like it. Wait, what? Amazing. What'd you say? He's been starting. Dallas, come up to LA. Let's okay, go. I'll, I'll, I'll move. We'll remove. I think we'll there's lots of seats available. So <laughs> we won tickets last year, and we were gonna go as a family. And we, we at the time had like a very little baby. Well, that will just bring him. And like, luckily, I think he or my wife was sick, so I took my older two kids, and we go. And there's like 
there's babies there, but they're in full on like warm gear with the big yeah. earphones that we were not going to put them in. And I got there. I was just like, wow, we dodged a bullet. I want to go to that building. Actually, I'd really like to see a game there. It's fun. If we ever get to be around people again, yes. they go with our... we're going to do that. I would love that. That'd make me very happy. <laughs> we'll, we'll rip some packs from the. Yeah. Uh, we'll I mean, we need like a, a pack rip live in a parking lot, I think. Yeah. That's, a socially not... distanced rip? Yeah. I, 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 well, do. yeah. When this is over, I guess. But... Right. No, we'll just we'll just throw them at each other six feet apart. Uh, <laughs> Let's see how we're doing. Shea Weber's legit. I mean, not worth stopping. All right. Nothing in there. Yeah. How do we yeah, feel about how do we feel about this design? I mean, just like the 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 gray and black side. I will say I'm not totally in love with the look of these cards. Joe, will you do you have a hockey card like where you're like I love this because I don't have a lot like to compare were... to. You. Yeah, I have. A, I mean, after this pack, I'll go grab my. It'll take two seconds. And I'll We've grab got, it. There's Tomas Hurdle. We so got probably probably holds up over time. We're just like all the Tukas. Mm. And once you throw that in my uh, quarterly uh, card stack, yeah, right. <laughs> we'll see how we'll see how your performance. <laughs> Someone pull up YouTube and let me know for streaming, and then I'll talk about. <laughs> I'm probably bending all these. I just I can't get it open. Now oh, they look alright. They look better than. So, Sean, are card. you are you segueing into becoming a hockey parent? Are you you know, move? it's a possibility when you live in San Jose. Let's see what we got here. We got a Tyler Benson. Tyler Benson. Um, youth hockey in San Jose is a big deal. That's and awesome. So um, I did get my youngest a little hockey set, like, a, you know, just a little net. He's one. But I mean, um, yeah. like some of my kids, like classmates have definitely, I'm like, oh, what are you guys doing? They're like, oh, yeah, we got, we got hockey practice. And they were like two. So... Oh. I don't know. I think it's like swim though, where you're just gonna end up there all day, all, like every is there weekend. A lot of, is there like a lot of available ice? That just to... the, we have. A, um, there's a place called Sharks Ice that's right by where the minor league Giants team plays, and there's like three rinks where they do all oh, kinds cool. of youth hockey and lessons and all stuff. So, what you're gonna do is end up. It's at like five in the morning. That's the yeah. Problem. That's early. Okay, we ready? I've been we warned a... several times. Don't let your kid play hockey because it's... Oh, we're back. Oh, Bo Horvat. That's legit. Cool. All right. Oh, I watched Stamkos tonight playing. Oh, he had a good game. They beat the Blackhawks, or they were beating the Blackhawks. They, they smoked the Blackhawks. That's what it looked like. So Here you go. These are the upper decks. Oh, man, that's a bad. That's terrible. Let's see. This is the upper decks I like, but I'll go back to this. Not right. feeling good about Lafreniere. So I put these... Um, Garbage Pail Kids names together for us because I thought it was funny, but Dallas, that was actually a card. I, like, I thought, oh, no, there was no Dallas Garbage Pail Kids, but there was. Bowling for <laughs> Dallas. Oh, uh, well. I, I The problem is, is it's so small I couldn't read it, Sean, so I couldn't give you the satisfaction of... If you can donate what, on YouTube uh, so we can buy Dallas a bigger laptop, we appreciate that. I have a really big laptop. It's just, maybe it's the way the... Oh, you got a really big laptop, huh? All right, what should we open? I got... We haven't opened one of these yet. This is the mega box. Right, do. Let's do that. We gotta get. Moving. Oh, I guess. Oh, I let's see. Can you see? What's my name, Joe? Or You're right Sean? back with legit. Hi, Bowl, bowling for Dallas. Bowling for Dallas. All right, Smokey Joe's taking a break. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take a moment to see if we're actually on YouTube, since no one's helping me out. Smokey Joe's uh, Cafe. Your channel. Let's see. Oh, looks like we are live. Hey, look at us. It's working. And no one's watching it, and there's no likes, and there's no comments. <laughs> perfect, perfect. You know, you just gotta keep going, Dallas. You gotta every keep going. Show, so, every show has this moment. Sean. This box, I don't care. <laughs> this box has, um, it's a lot of wasted. Do you remember when we bought CDs and they had the really big box? Yeah, um, yeah. Remember those? I do. Yep. I feel like this needs to be the next thing that goes away because that's just a waste of card. Dallas, what was your first CD? The one that was like a foot long. Oh, the first CD that was a foot long was um, Digital Underground Sex Packets. Nice. Shit. Your mom let you buy yeah. that? No, my sister bought it for me. Nice. Yeah, at Fan Mart in yes. uh, Oklahoma. Yeah. 
Yeah, and I remember her pulling it out of her Fido jacket <laughs> and giving it to me. <laughs> Damn. She pulled it yeah. out of her jacket? Did she buy it? Probably stole it. Okay. All right, come on, buddy. Adam Fox, that's a very... Okay, we got a young gun. It is Pierre Olivier Joseph. I do that right? Yeah. It's a very oh, French experience. pronunciation. Add him up. Add Speaking him up. of young guns, here's an upper deck that I like the look of. There's your Sergei Fedorov young guns. That's nice. And I don't yeah, know if great. they do throwback stuff like that. They should. Well, There's there a lot. Like... Look, man, I, I took it took me like a half a year to understand like where baseball's at. So, you know. Yeah, I know. I know that similar to the way how Tops produces tons of um, different products, Upper Deck does the same with hockey. But this is the main one, Series One. Come on, baby! All right, Adrian. We got a portrait of. I don't know. Max Pacioretty. All right. Whoa, Joe, what happened to your back? Mine. It's your house. I, I took it off so I could show you cards. Oh, so cool. I could show you upper deck cards that look good. I was doing well for a while. We were really moving through these. Yeah. We hit a dry spell on the, I mean, we've got some, we're hitting some repeats on the basics. Well, and I meant to like about like opening them. All right. There's mats. Mats. We got a dazzler of... Quinn Hughes. Oh, that's a good one. That's good. Nice. These are really Ooh. cool. All right. I'll have to go back through all these and see if there's any actually French ones or if that's just something that someone made up. Well, that there's some French writing on that pack that you just opened. The pack? Or the, the, the pack that's in frame here at the top has the French okay, writing. Okay, so that, so, all right. So we opened that tin. And yeah. This is a mega box. It has the same amount of packs as the tin did, and then its bonus pack is this one, which is, uh, yeah, I guess it's French. En français. Yeah. All right. Let's see. What we got In here. Fire. Portrait of Tyler Benson. Oh, he doesn't really look like a hockey see, he's player. Not, no, he's no, not. No, not at all. He looks like an exec. He doesn't, he doesn't deserve that background. <laughs> All right. You were expecting seven and a half young guns were at 10 already. I mean, no, I was expecting hit, hit a 15. 15. 15 and a half. But that's if we got through everything, and I don't think we're going to have time to get through everything. No. So, so actually, I think we're doing pretty good. We have 10. And the um, that canvas Gallardi was nice. Maybe we run back the hockey, run it back maybe around the All Star break, or is that? Yeah, yeah there'll probably be yeah. a series two, um, so, I mean, of this, which we can get and see. Some these are like sticking together a little bit. Oh no, that's not. Um, we got a canvas of that guy. <laughs> the Devils. Okay. That guy looks like a real jerk. Devils. So. There aren't any of the Kraken in here, which would make sense because none of those guys have... They have They have no players yet. They don't start until next season. When is the expansion draft? Oh, It'll be in... I think it's scheduled for July of next year. Okay. But yeah. Jeez. I was curious. I didn't know that. Thank you, Joe. Like I said, everything I know about hockey, propaganda lyrics. Um, Michael. Right. Oh, we got another. We already got hit, Igor, right? Yeah, we get a different. Did we get like a? Is there are there two Igors. Like, is is Igor the new Connor in twenty twenty one? No, we got him. We got him. All right, Igor. Well, I'm still gonna add it. It counts. It counts. Oh, it counts. Count for it. Sure. If we got two Lafreniere's. Eleven young guns. So Joe, do they just? Is it just? So there's no other expansion team, right? No, because they brought in Vegas. So they just protect how how many? guys do they protect on each roster it's i think that it's that you can keep it's like five forwards and yeah four defensemen or something like that it's like it's a it's a pretty low number weirdly a canvas of that's what happened with the Knights. oh yes that's, that's a good the one man. oh yeah that's a great one 
Sweet. Look at that mustache. He's like the he's maybe on his way to being the best player in the league if he Sweet. if he can put it together. And he's from Arizona. I read a um I read an Hockey article capital of the they, world. they thought he would lead the league in scoring this year. Yeah, Is I think that that's, big? That's good the the Maple Leafs should be a really fun team to watch this year. And Sweet. they maybe can't they maybe are weak in goal, so they, they should have some like good back and forth games. Isn't there like a big there's a big Arizona youth? Scene, I mean, I think right? it's in all these. I mean, one, a lot of the players live there in the off season, and then LA, you know, and, yeah. that's the result of like having a team in having a team in Arizona leads to that. And it's like mm-hmm. one of the best players in the league is um, one best defenseman, Seth Jones, whose dad is Popeye Jones, and he his dad was playing in Denver for the Nuggets. And oh right, okay. He, like that was when the Avalanche were great, and he was like, I want to do that instead, and he played hockey. Yeah. Okay, let's see if we can do it. We'll That's do a this. good card, too. We'll do this, and we'll like do that. a fat pack, and we'll call it a night. Great. Get another Quinn Hughes. Yeah. Pavelski. Weird. See, I like, the old, I like the old Canucks jersey. Yeah, yeah, the, the, the Blade one. Panarin's yeah. legit. I mean, these are all basic cards. What do you call They're not basic, right? Stock? These are, yeah, these are the base cards. They call base. That's the yeah. one. Like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's like the one that makes up the you know the set. Yeah. Okay. Oh, well, and we have to open this. We'll do that after this fat pack. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you're on YouTube, please leave a like and subscribe. If you're on Twitter, I hope the audio worked. <laughs> this is a fat pack. Yeah. This is a fat pack. Let's see if he's is in here. A, is that with a pH or? An, uh, <laughs> <laughs> if he's in here, it's with a pH. Okay. All right. Kind of a bummer because these kind of get spoiled if I don't do it this way. I think he could be in here though. Let's see. I like those old devils with the red and green. Timo. Come on, buddy. We know you're in there. John Marino. to get shut out. Mm. Dallas is falling asleep. No, I just I'm it's not looking good. It's not looking good. Uh, maybe last That's a really one. weird photo. Be weird. I don't think we got anything in this pack. Yeah, that was a there was a ton of stars in this pack. But we got no inserts, right? No inserts. A ton of Texas stars. <laughs> I'm just gonna look in the back real quick and see if we missed anything. See if there's any French writing. I try okay, to we're gonna nail one. We're gonna nail one on one of these, and we're gonna. It's gonna lose it's gonna our minds. I'm gonna angrily <laughs> rip through the rest of it tonight and find. I appreciate it. all the. <laughs> of course. Yeah. If you rip through the rest and you pull that if, and you pull it, it's gonna be. What? I mean, it'll be fine, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll sa- I'll save it for the for another night. Okay, let's see. What we got these are called team triples. I don't know what that is. Oh, I guess it's. Yeah. Okay. It's three guys from a team on a So card. it's not just a clever name. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go. How do they leave Connor McDavid off of this card, by the way? What is happening That's here? Is and... there French on the back of that card? Yeah, I don't know. Let's and they see. left Stankos off that one. They weird choices. There's no French and there's no who? McDavid? Stan... Yeah, McDavid and Stankos would be the two guys. Although they might have been expecting Stankos to not be in Tampa anyway. You know, I don't know. I don't know what Upper Deck is doing. It doesn't matter though. I had a It'd lot be a of tough fun. way to find out you were traded. <laughs> yeah. So I would say the card, <laughs> the card of the night was that Velarde UDV canvas. Got a bunch of young guns. That was really fun. I mean, you know, it's yeah. not very expensive, and you can find it. I don't know if you guys know this, but everyone buys every football card, every basketball card. So to be able to find cards at a Target when you're out buying milk or something, and then you know, it's really fun. I recommend getting uh, some of this just if you're a fan at all. You know, I'm not even a huge fan, but trying to find the young guns is fun. And maybe some of these guys I'll follow this season. So I don't know. I like it. I, I think we learned a lot from from our good pal Joe. Hey tonight. Sean, somebody wants to talk to you. <laughs> so does please he feel keep, like it was feel like please it was keep a, looking for me? Please <laughs> keep out. Joe, I'm Joe, lost in one of these boxes. I'm out of here. <laughs> Joe, Joe, I, I just have one more question. Like, so when when if I commit icing, what what exactly am I doing wrong? 
<laughs> we'll, t- we'll talk about it off air. We'll talk yeah, about yeah, I'll answer that later. <laughs> Leave a like and subscribe if you're on YouTube. Thank you, everyone, for watching. We are Tox Chrome. We'll be back live hopefully next week opening some baseball cards, something that I know a little bit more about. Not a ton, but a little. For Dallas and Joe <laughs> and Nick, thanks again. Good night.